<laughs> yeah. They, they learned when they were, when they were at the one. Because he wouldn't have named his son like, Porgy's D A. You feel me? Like he named his son the D A. <laughs> one, 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 one. First of all, you got it. <laughs> the DNA. Oh my god! But this he would have to. He would have to. Talk is crazy. <laughs>I do have a question, so I'm going to put this up. We have a new little spoiler <laughs> warning right here, right? So we got a spoiler warning for people because we're going to talk about One Piece, right? Because One Piece had a recent chapter. My question for everybody here, it's got up with One Piece, is at this point, Vegapunk was about to answer a question of what is the D-Clan. He was about to drop an integral part of information and lore for the One Piece story. What do you think he was about to say? What do you think he was about to say? I think he was saying something's in the D clan. It was something like that. It was in the D clan. But what do y'all think he was about to say? Miles. I don't really know what kid daddy was finna say. Leave me alone. I don't <laughs> fucking know either. You're all one piece expert. Do your job. <laughs> Yo, I, it's hard to do my job at this point. <laughs> so. I, 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 I honestly don't know either, bro. I feel like with one piece, I, it could go any route. I, I wouldn't know either, to be honest. There's just too many things it could be. It could yeah. be the name of a person, the name of an attribute, a place. Yeah. I just don't know where he's going with it. Yeah, maybe, the they're, maybe, they're connected, it. maybe they're connected to make sure the world doesn't fall, sink into itself. I don't know. Like, Yeah, the only thing we really know, know is that they're, they're the enemy of the gods and they can be passed on on multiple people. So, they like, could we. Be if, car- oh, my bad. My bad. Sorry. No, no, no. It's just that's all I'm about to say. We, we just are the enemy of the, the celestial dragons. They could, they so could be reincarnations. If, Maybe I saw a theory like that. Of, yeah. of past lives, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I really don't know, bro. I don't know. But you know what? I wonder, like, how do you get the name? Does someone bestow the name upon you? To be like, oh, you will be like, because I, I mean, obviously they named Luffy, but like, was it like, oh, I just wanted to name you D, or like, did Dragon be like, oh, you're going to be the next D? Like, well, how you well, like, well, I, I, well, I do, like, well, I, well, I do think we can safe for us to assume that Roger knew what the D meant. No, I feel like did. Roger knew everything. Yeah, he did. He did. Yeah, yeah Roger. Roger, Roger white 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 knew. Yo, that is like <laughs> Roger. Roger told. Yeah. Roger told <laughs> yeah. They, they learned when they, were, when they were at the one because he wouldn't named his yeah. son Porgy's D Ace. You feel me? Like he named his son with the D. In- <laughs> well, 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 first of all, you got it. <laughs> the DNA. Oh my god! But this he would have to. This deep talk is crazy. <laughs> Um, also, also the quote, unless the, uh, unless there's some translation that differs, because more and more I talk to Ty, the more I realize I can't really trust these translations all the time, but they said, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it gets, it gets but on Reddit, like on Reddit and stuff. Yeah. I no, mean, I, I, don't, I don't know, but, um, he said, who bear the name of D within you, there is. So it makes me think that it has to do with their like lineage Yeah, because w- when do yeah. you say within, right? It has to be something with your lineage, mm-hmm. and maybe it could just be as simple as like they were the guys before the royals, sure. they were the ones in charge before the royals were, and they got taken over. Can someone remind me? Didn't Sengoku call say that Ace had demon blood? Like he did, did he say that? Yeah, so yeah, I, I mean, I'm not 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 little demons, but it has something to do with their bloodline, I would assume. Like, yeah. I know it, if you say, Oh, you're Roger's son, you're you have the devil's blood, but like. I, what if he's alluding to something with the will of Diggs? I'm assuming like a Sengoku race. Sengoku probably there, it, 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 does, it does seem like there are certain people in the government that do know because even Akainu was like, yo, is he really going to tell everything? Kind of alluding yeah. to the fact that because of his position, he may have some insight, if not the whole thing, at least some matter of it. Um, yeah. Yeah, because even Sengoku was like, when he's about to talk to One Piece, Sengoku was like, hey, don't say that. So, like, he must. He was stress eating. So, so that means that I think that. Obviously, the people that went to One Piece know about it, and then some people within the government, like like for example, he knew about the whole God Valley situation. So we know they had they know insiders things. So I always know. thought I always thought it was like just a clan or like maybe like an island or from where Nika originally came from, or like the people that Nika or Joy Boy originally came from, because we've seen them wipe whole civilizations and whole clans of people before, like how kings like how kings like the last of his people and stuff like that. So I'm just assuming, or I was I just kind of assumed that. Whoever the original D people were, they were a part of the original clan that like went against them or whatever, and they got taken out. But like the spirit of them lives on in other people, or maybe some of their some of them are actually blood related to those people, etc. I feel like Targaryen bloodline type stuff. Yeah, yeah, and I mean, 
the whole thing of being another clan seems obvious, right? You don't need to stop the recording for that. So it must be another level of that. It must be yeah. something even beyond just being another clan. And mm -hmm. I'm thinking, like, maybe these D clan members are just a different type of human mm -hmm. than every other human. Because we've seen some D clan members like Luffy and Roger kind of maybe this is tied to the D clan or something else to hear the voices of all things, right? They're able to do an ability that just nobody else is ever able to replicate. Maybe Blackbeard, because he has this numerous souls in his body, mm -hmm. is also just they're just like maybe even like higher beings than well, any other. I mean, like, I think I think law, law and kid have these in their name too, don't they? Only law, kid not kid. Law. Yeah, kid doesn't. Only law. I feel yeah. like I feel like Eustace is gonna be a D at some point. No, no weird. I just I feel like it could happen. You know, that's my dog. So I'm always rooting for. I love him too, man. I, I'm rooting for this kid. And also, you know, I, I I hope that's Vegapunk's son. You know, he might have a will of D in him. We just don't know. You feel me? I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to leave out the possibility. Come on, bro. That's what it's called. I don't want to leave out the possibility <laughs> for my dog, kid, for my dog, kid. But I will say this: the way Riddell, you were talking about things being chosen. I mean, it was confirmed, right? That uh, Devil Fruits kind of find that can follow their user or choose their user kind of how um luffy got his fruit so i mean i don't think people people being selected is above reproach you know like impossibility yeah uh, i think it, it could all just be like a, a prophecy like i think and it, what leads me to think that's really what white said marine forward and also just things that we've seen in the past like for example um i forgot chopper's that lady that was on Drum Island, I forgot her name, the old lady, when she was basically talking about the, yeah. the will of D is still alive and she was talking about fate. And then we see Roger, basically, when, when we see that flashback where White Bear is talking to Roger, he's like, yo, what's the will of D about? And he was like, all right, I'll tell you about it. And then he said, White Bear's next response is basically like, someone's going to find the One Piece. So it leads me to think that the will of D has something to do with finding the One Piece, which means it's probably a prophecy that these select people are meant to do. They're meant to fulfill a certain prophecy. Either which people or a person, because White Bear kind of elaborated and he tells Black Bear, it's not you. Like exactly. you're not the, you're not the person that's gonna be the one to shake the world up. So right. yeah, so I think I think that aligns with like there's a prophecy that they have a fill, even even that they were too early means that these specific people can't do it. So mm -hmm. I think it'd just be a big prophecy that these select group of people are gonna take down the world or change the world mm -hmm. at some point. And the government's like, nah, we, we like our we like we like the way things are. I guess well. kind of yeah. piggyback on what you said. The person who I think might be a D, um yeah. Odin and their family. Oh, yeah. that could happen too. I can see that. Yeah, Odin and that. Momo and all of them because mm -hmm. they kind of hold mm -hmm. a lot of historical significance in the Facts. story. They Facts. made the Poneglyphs. They're very, Facts. very important. So I can oh, yeah, see both that. Of all games in Momo's case too. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see that too. Actually, that's actually a great point, Miles. I can see that too. Yeah, and it's also kind of crazy that um we found out Vivi and her family. This is part of the D clan. Mm -hmm. which, yeah. which, the one mm -hmm. that's throwing me off now that like we're thinking everything. The fact that a giant is also a part of the D clan is, is like he's a very unique case and compared to everybody we've seen. For we've like he's a whole different type, technically race of race. Yeah, yeah. I mean, maybe his daddy just like the stallion. Yeah, we don't I was know. about to say that. He yeah, might, he might, yeah, I'm gonna say you don't know the problem is we don't know who these folks' parents be. I mean, that could lead to us thinking that Joy Boy is a giant based off of that big straw hat. So true. Mm -hmm. Fair, fair, okay, 